great. So first of all, what's your name? And Joe Halley. And you are the mayor of? Oak Harbor. All right. Well, tell me a little bit about how you got involved in this case and, and your interest in it. Uh, merely by accident. So uh, I joined the Army when I was 18, went off, served my country. Um, when I came back home, like a lot of us do, I, I tried to exercise my, exercise my right to vote. Uh, and when I did, I was told I wasn't registered. Um, I filed absentee for my rack while I was there uh, during my time in service. However, that absentee ballot clearly didn't make it. Mm -hmm. um, so I was purged. Uh, I found out, cried because of it, re-registered there on the spot. However, my provisional ballots that I filed in that election and the previous one weren't counted. Um, my involvement though today is I post on a random Facebook post uh, and, and folks saw that I was a veteran, saw that it's an important issue for veterans as well. Uh, and got my story out and got me involved. Do you tie that experience being purged to actually becoming mayor later on or no? Uh, not, not really no. directly, but now that I've been doing this for a while uh, and working with people in general, uh, I've become more of a veteran's advocate for you know, for, for my class because we, we need a voice and we need voice with leadership in, in elected office. What did it mean for you to ha to know that your vote, that your registration had been purged, that you've been purged from the voter rules in Ohio while you were abroad? It, it was crushing. It, it was heartbreaking to be told that you can go off and serve your country and defend that very right, but when you come home you can't exercise it. It, it was terrible. Did you, uh, did you communicate with the Secretary of State's office about this? I mean, what sort of communication did you have protesting this before today? <laughs> uh, the Board of Elections, they were sympathetic. They told me their hands were tied. Uh, they told me to contact Secretary of State's office, to which I did, uh, and they told me because I wasn't there, it, it's kind of an unfortunate thing for service members if, if they're off serving their country. However, there was nothing they could do about it. Oh, all right. Well, hey, thank you so much for, 